Hey, how's it going? This is Robin Williams from TheRealRobinWilliams.com and I teach internet marketers and network marketers how to get more leads and sales online using proven strategies. And in this video, I'm going to show you uh, how you can get access to step-by-step uh, -step video tutorials on how to build your blog from scratch. Um, so what you're looking at right now is the back office of the training uh, that will show you from A to Z how you could build your blog or Maybe you're thinking, you know, once you go through this video, maybe you'll be thinking, um, maybe this blog building is too much for me. Um, you could also uh, learn how you can actually um, get a custom made blog for you, for yourself if you choose not to build your blog. But anyway, let me cut to it. So I'm in the back office here. Um, as you can see, is one of 12 videos loaded here for blogging. And like I said, uh, some trainers you go through, and it might teach you how to design a blog or create a page, but they don't teach you how to create it from scratch. Um, so this first video pretty much talks about why you should even blog. And if you don't already have a niche for your blog, like something you want to blog about, you definitely want to focus on that and uh, find out what that is because that's basically uh, something you want to start before you even, um, you know, consider blogging. Uh, or start creating your blog. So right here we go over uh, why blogging and this is uh, Mike Hobbs here doing this particular training. Um, you want to know uh, why it's important for you to blog. Why should you blog? What is it? To me it's your home on the internet, right? Um, for me, I can go out there, put content on there and email it to my list, post it on my Facebook so that people can see what I have going on. Um, if you are into search engine optimization, which is this uh, way to rank your video, your blogs online, then you probably understand the power of blogging, you know, for somebody to go to a search engine and type in something that they want or need and find your blog. That's very powerful. So there's some of the stuff that he covers in this video. So I'm just going to scroll down, try to get through these videos. Um, basically, we go over the fact that you can outsource it, so you don't have to build your own blog, and we'll tell you exactly, you know, what you need to do to outsource it, and some really good outsource, um, <clears throat> outsourcing um, companies that you can go through as well. Uh, I'll show you some examples of some blogs that was created from scratch at the end of this video, as well as a, a blog that was outsourced. Um, as you see right here, we go over a little bit of it uh, as far as Upwork and Fiverr, and then we also show you where you can get custom blogs. Self-hosted WordPress, so basically you need a place to host your, your website. So basically if you consider it like a piece of real estate, you need to put your house on a piece of land, right? Um, so it, it tells you what you need to do so that your uh, blog could be up and running. Right here, you got the um, another system. So, like I said, uh, you could build your stuff from scratch. What I didn't cover was that um, not only can you build it from scratch and can you get someone to purchase it, uh, but what I do is I go through a different system. So it's kind of like uh, in between. Like part of it is already done for you, um, but a lot of it you do on your own. So uh, something I have is uh, that's in between is basically a system that I can use to build my blog and once I get everything set up you really just have to do the hosting and then start blogging or designing your blog so uh, that's what he covers in this one and I can show you my blog as an example of a blog that was created on a different platform uh, so it's kind of like in between you don't do all of the work but I mean you still do a lot of it in most of these systems anyway alrighty here we go. This is a walkthrough of the hitter and sidebars. If you want to know how to get the sidebars and the hitter on your website um, up and running properly, you definitely want to go through this training. Go through pages and menus. These are the main things you want to have in your blog. So when you go to a person's blog, you definitely want to have your pages, menus, sidebars, hitters, maybe some categories, stuff like that. And it'll show you step by step how to set all of that up. Opt-in forms and banners. Um, a lot of people have blogs or websites, but they don't have a way for, to build a list. So building a list is important in internet marketing. If you plan on building a business or anything like that, you want to make sure you have a place where people can put their email and their name or phone number uh, so that you can build your list and co contact them or follow up with them with, uh, with whatever service that you have going on. All right, the next video goes over 
useful plugins and over overall finish customization so it's a lot of different plugins and all this is is basically uh like little tools i call them like little tools um that you can or little pieces of software even that you can install on your blog for it to do some other stuff like things that you wouldn't be able to do if you didn't install the plugin so for instance is a like a facebook like uh plugin that i have on my blog and what that allows uh, people to do is come in and they can see my uh, Facebook page on my blog and they can you know either go to my Facebook page or just click the like to my Facebook page right from my blog so without that plugin I wouldn't be able to have that Facebook little box on my blog so that's all the plugins are but it'll go over some of the most you know some of the uh, most common plugins there uh, a blogging strategy content creation tips like once you get the blog up it doesn't do anything on its own um, some people not everybody but some people have this misconception that I have a website I'm in business no there's certain strategies you need to do on your blog you know every day or every uh, week however often you want to uh, blog but it's certain strategies you need to do on your blog to to basically get any type of results whether you I mean at minimum your goal should be at least to get viewers and readers right we have some blogs out there that are just for the masses to read or whatever um so at minimum you should do that right so you need to still build content and and market your your blog and all that stuff in order for it to work right and some people may not just have um the basic uh goal to build and you know to build viewers and stuff some people might want to get leads and sales so uh, either way, you still have to develop a blogging strategy that you can do each and every day. Or, it, depending, they'll go over in the video. Maybe it's not every day. Maybe it's once a week. All right, and it's the overall shoulder walkthrough. Like, for me, I know that looking at somebody over the shoulders always helps me in my business. And that's why I really enjoy um, this system in general because it doesn't just cover blogging it covers you know some of the marketing and everything like that that, it, that you should do and a lot of times in internet marketing we we, t we see people post about how awesome their uh, system is and how you should join and get in and I'll show you everything or tell you everything I need to do and you get in but you really don't see what it is that they do in here um, throughout this actual uh, site you get to see what that person does um, and we got another one emailing your blog to your list this is a cool way to get some free traffic they just go over that um, if you already have a list built uh, you can definitely email it it's the same thing for Facebook uh, or if you're building a list in many chat or a Facebook chat bot um, you can email your your Facebook I mean your blog link to those people to get the uh, traffic going there uh, and then you got some sharing in social media. So basically, you know, how are you going to spread your message across the social media sites that you're using? Uh, you definitely want to make sure you, excuse me, you definitely want to make sure you're doing that um, once you actually build your blog. And the next uh, couple minutes, I'm just going to show you some examples here. Um, before I do, actually, this system. Once you uh, get into the system, uh, which is like a, a trial, a very um, affordable trial, and that you can access at the description, the top of the description of my video. But once you get into the system, I just want to show you real quick um, that you also get some training on how to market. So maybe you start a blog, but you don't know what to do with it once you create it because um, you don't want it just sitting out there doing nothing. So uh, we we have training back here on how you can start to market your blog so maybe you want to do some youtube uh ranking um and then it's some other simple things low tech that you can do in order to start marketing your blog and then we also have some training as of now uh what is this february 4th 2018 um this is what's coming in the future we have facebook live training ppc youtube ppc instagram so you definitely want to know how to push your blog out there to the market. Um, so that was important for me to um, say that before I go on and give you some examples. Uh, here's an example of my website, which I said is kind of like in between, right? I didn't build this from scratch. I, I used a system, but I did a lot of the building 
um, on my own. I did all of the designing on my own. And if you need help designing on a Divi platform, I can also help you with that as well um, if you were to get into the system. But um, basically, uh, you know, I use basically all of it is pretty much the same except for the front part, like I said in the beginning. Um, <clears throat> here you got the pages and stuff that I built. I have a blog that I just have going on right there and got a little video in the back but you see I have my blog post here um, I could also have like little links and videos and stuff in here so that's just the blog po post that I have a lot of this is the designing most of everything on how to do this will be in the training um, but like me I just you know design a little bit uh, more and that was mine let me go ahead and show you a couple that was built from scratch uh, this is uh, one of my teammates Francisco did a really good job he went um, I actually talked to him he went from from scratch like from the beginning to the end and built a blog I said you, you know yo, your blog is amazing you know and so basically what he uh, told me is that he used the training that I just showed you to go ahead and build his blog he did a little bit of like a about me page right here uh, showing a little bit about his family and stuff um, he has an actual blog uh, section where uh, he writes his blogs at very professional nice clean sleek looking I like it um, got a little pop-up here and my battery's down I got nine nine percent left guys um, <clears throat> And then he has some other pages here. So I just see his top marketing tools. Okay, he got books, autoresponders, lead capture pages. So he has a list of tools that you can use. Very clean. And like I said, this is somebody who actually used everything outside of the, um, the Home Business Academy and the uh, system that I showed you. So here we go with Paul Hunches, Hutchings, one of my mentors. Uh, here in the HBA uh, basically built his blog from scratch and um, as you can see it's very clean sleek uh, he has his blog post that's right there uh, just have his lead capture page or you know a place where people can put their email in there uh, a little bit about him uh, and that's pretty much it so let me see here let me go to home real quick Uh, so as his home page, he built a kind of, it's kind of like a lead capture page as well. Um, but you can do your home page however you want. So on his home page, he's basically telling you how he sponsored 1,293 um, people to his team. And um, when I go and click there, I'll be redirected to uh, like a lead capture page. So it's pretty cool. Um, and the last one I'm going to go over is one that was a custom blog. So basically the person that was given the training, Mike Hobbs, he actually paid someone to build his blog. Um, obviously if you do it, if you go this route, you have to pay a lot more money. A lot of people like to build on their own, so they won't pay that amount, but you'll be paying in time versus, uh, going to get a custom blog where you'll just be paying out of pocket and you'll save your time. So depending on what avenue you like to take or you rather take that training is in there on you know who to contact and stuff like that so basically it's a nice cool very professional uh, blog uh, one of the things I really like about getting it built is the nice professional uh, hitters and stuff like that um, but I'll just click on another piece but basically this is just giving you an example if you were to go and get it built but like I said in the description of the video at the um, top of the description of this video you'll be able to click on a link and um, get more information about the system that I'm showing you and it will teach you how to create your blog from scratch without any of the hassle from A to Z there's no oh but we forgot this you know so it's A to Z on how to create your blog from scratch and um, also consider the marketing training in there because once you create the training, you have to decide what do you do with it. I mean, what, once you create the blogging uh, platform, you have to decide what to do with it now. So uh, definitely get in there, uh, get your blog set up. If you have any questions, I have uh, my Facebook information in the description of this video as well. Uh, definitely hit me up and I'll see you on the top.